Um, Stoning my projects generally tend to be in bathrooms, kitchens, areas where there's um, high usage, need durability or wet surfaces. So currently I've been using stoning bathrooms, we've been tending to use quite on it marbles, we've been dissecting them and creating patination out of them rather than leaving them free flowing like you've seen for you know a number of years. Um, seems quite strange sometimes to dissect quite a precious marble but I feel you get more usage and more depth from what's been created. Because of the recession people no longer want cheap and cheerful flat pack glitz, that falseness, they want the correct quality and something that lasts and they're prepared to pay for that and wait a little longer and I think from that that's meant that the uh, sustainability of a product like natural stone has really come back into its own. Predominantly we will use it in floor, floor finishes and we'll use it in bathrooms as well um, and we'll, we'll, we'll use it in conjunction with other materials like um, um, antique bronze strips and um, but also we'll incorporate details like shadow gaps. So for the projects that I'm working on currently which is a residential project in Knightsbridge uh, I use the stone for vanity units, for cladding of bathrooms, for um, floor details um, so the selection is very important and also the thickness of stone is very important so if we can find good quality um, and also if we can find good continuity in the, the vein of the stone, uh, we're always impressed.